The president of top-tier Turkish soccer club Ankara Gücü, Farak Koja, was arrested on Tuesday for punching referee Halil Umut Maler in the face at the end of a match on Monday evening. The referee told police that he was also kicked while lying on the pitch, and that Koja also threatened to kill him and his colleagues, local media reported. Turkey's justice minister said two others were arrested for injuring a public official. Hello, Sayın Cumhurbaşkanı, merhabalar. Lying in a hospital bed in a neck brace, Maler spoke to Turkish President Tayyip Erdogan as the soccer world reeled from the violence. The Turkish Football Federation said it had suspended all leagues after the shameful incident in Ankara. Footage showed Koja coming onto the field and hitting Maler when the final whistle blew. After Riza Spore scored a 97th minute equaliser in the 1 1 draw at Erman Stadium. The Justice Minister said on social media platform X that the investigation is continuing meticulously, while fellow referee Arda Kardesla spoke on behalf of Malaya. Günaydınlar herkese. Dün akşam yaşananları herkes gördü. Söyleyecek hiçbir şeyimiz yok. Good morning, everyone. Everyone saw what happened last night. We have nothing to say. We gathered with all the referees. Our federation and the Central Referee Committee said they will support every decision that we will take and postpone the whole league. However, right now we are not in a state to discuss or think about refereeing. Our only current priority is for our friend Halilu Mutmeler to return to health and his family as soon as possible. Medics said Meler's fracture will heal, there is no brain damage and he is likely to be discharged on Wednesday. The federation said Ankara Guju, its chairman, club officials and all those guilty of attacking the referee will be punished in the strongest terms possible. FIFA president Gianni Infantino said the events were totally unacceptable and have no place in our sport or society.